but right into the tropics. You've heard about Florida, right? Over 18 inches of rain. I'd seen reports in South Florida. This tropical wave, 90L. This tropical wave in Central America is the one that could be bringing quite a rain to us. Right now, a lot of wind shear being fought with this system. Really tough to get organized. One reason why the National Hurricane Center says very low chances development, but now medium chances, 40% chance as we get into next week that there in the Bay of Campeche, we could have development. Our forecast in one of the best out of the United States has been showing this tropical wave joining with other energy in Central America, diving and driving in waves of showers and storms connected to the possibility of formation of something tropical coming into the Gulf. Now that stays far southwest of us here. We're just topping chalking tropical connections to these waves, but the going forecasts have been converging and this one out of Europe of keeping the heaviest storms southwest of us. The European computer forecast really keeps most of that rain centered along that system. Mexico here. Here's Texas right there. Brownsville, Texas. So it's just about our connection to the storm systems and coming in. Now the rain chances really drastically being lowered with a lot more the rain, the farther south and west you're going to be going closer to that system. So the takeaways of systems next week, beginning Father's Day Sunday, is the heaviest rain stays southwest of us. Tropical potential, there's no chance of that system heading us, hitting us with this round. Storm Sunday could be lasting though through next week as we'll watch.